Hi everyone, it's uh, Cathy Rowan here in Bundaberg, Queensland, just straightening you up a little bit, bring you in there, there we go, I think that looks alright. Okay, so as I said, Cathy Rowan here in Bundaberg, Queensland, and you see before you a 12 by 16 inch or 30 by 40 centimetre canvas, which I did do a pour on, and it's been sitting there for a while, and it really doesn't do anything for me, as pretty as it is. It's lost its power. So, I thought I could just paint over it and um, maybe get something a little bit different, a little bit nicer. Something else that will have a bit of a wow factor, which this one doesn't seem to have. So, I have black, white, gold, yellow and red. And I'm going to do this. to do this too as soon as it spreads out a little bit. Okay, you've spread. I think that's maybe not. I just want it a bit like making pancakes really. <laughs> Alright, I think that should do it. Well, it's just a little glass bowl which can be washed and okay that's about the middle right now I have rather a large container liberated from my son's um, business <laughs> I do that sometimes Anyway, so I'm just going to pull this up as though it was going to be a ring pour, which is basically what it will be. And there is no silicon in any of these colours. And maybe a little bit of black in there. don't have a lot of yellow, but we'll put some in anyway. So there's yellow, red, gold, black, white, and I might just finish it off with the last of that yellow. And then we'll see how we go. Okay, so there it is. Very pretty in there. Take it over this way. And start. Pouring, pouring, pouring. It has made some really pretty patterns around this edge here. I'll just give it a second to dribble down and uh, well, hopefully this will be really, really pretty. Alright, so I want to do I'm do is put that under there because then the drip-offs can go onto the record.
Oops, I don't want to move it. That's that one done. This is a little bit more difficult than I had envisaged. But we're getting there. And as it goes over that edge, You can come off. Wow, that would look really pretty. I'm just going to lift. I might just see what I have here and do a little bit more and that seemed a bit just for fun the recipes for these paints and pouring medium You'll find below the video under show more. Okay, and there's some colour in here too, so I may as well, while I'm at it, get the lot. down, give them a little help. I think most of those colours are coming off the basin. Most of these corners while I'm waiting. I would have liked some little wispy bits coming off here so and it's not happening so I'm going to give it a bit of a help
right, I'm very happy here. Got the fingerprints again. Alright, so now I'm going to torch it. I'll just wash my hands first and see how we go. Just see where I want to put the torch there and see where it lighter over here, no doubt. It's a shame that I, that didn't stay more circular, but I mean, that is what it is. So I'm quite, quite happy, I think. Um, Alright, so I'll move this around a bit and bring it down to have a look. This is what I've been looking at. And there's not much in the cell line. Uh, just a little bit from the flow trial. As I said, I didn't put any OGX in it. If you haven't already subscribed, please do. Click the little bell beside that word uh, under this video and you will be notified then as I put more videos up into uh, YouTube. And that does look 3D, doesn't it, a bit? Yeah, which is what I was aiming for so that's okay I do hope you've enjoyed this uh, please give it the thumbs up and I'll catch you in the next one bye for now